fast. So this would uh, this would really help him if he surprises us here. That's Four, five nine. We'll take that. We'll take that all day long. With, uh, Kalani Sataki, they will they will punch you in the mouth too. Now that's a physical group. He's moving pretty good. Four six four. That's okay. That that's kind of what I thought. I think when we pulled the numbers on James Conner, that'll be an interesting. Well, comparison. Connor had an incredible season. Thirteen touchdowns also. <laughs> Four four five. Wow, Charles. Always evaluating. It's, that, it's, that, it's all that playoff money they've collected over the years. Bradway's up, upgraded his wardrobe a little bit from our days scouting together in Philadelphia. Did you know they took Clyde Edwards Eli out of LSU in the first round a couple of years ago? Letty Brown. West Virginia, 473. Yeah, he's kind of an inside pounder as a runner. Um, so speed's not really, that's not really his calling card. Interesting player crash during a week. And it was a significant enough where the airbags deployed. And he said, uh, oh, Tyler, you're going to be okay. He said, Coach, I play running back in the SEC. A car crash is not going to keep me down. He went and rushed for 200-plus yards that week against South Carolina. 1,600 rushing yards on 268 carries, 14 rushing touchdowns this season. And Beatty with a nice 4-4-9 there. Tyrion Davis Price. High knees runner. Remember Roger Craig's running style with those high knees? This kid has kind of a similar running style. You should take those high knees to the Hall of Fame, Roger Craig, by the way. A thousand and a thousand. Four, five, eight. Stacy? Some point in time later today, but you can see what he does in the passing game again. Not someone you're going to give as many touches to in the run game as his brother, mm -hmm. but he can do a lot of damage with five or six catches out of the backfield. Four five oh, That's right there, oh. He's right there. Oh. Oh, Dalvin loved that, huh? I don't know. It's unofficial. It's unofficial. There's a round of applause from the fans here. Let's throw him up here. Look at that. Yeah, I didn't. Dalvin's He's already got him in the vert. He's gotten him in the vert. Alrighty. Yeah, that's go. one of those ones with the vert that's a mystery to me. Dalvin Cook, you look at how explosive he is with the Minnesota Vikings, and they say he jumped 30 and a half inches. Reminds me of Shady McCoy. On teams that weren't great at Tennessee, he was still productive at team offensive MVP. He was voted team captain after arriving in January. Tells you a little something, too. 466 for Snoop Connor out of Ole Miss. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm a Snoop Connor guy. I gave him a grade that kind of places him in that. Third round at 4.66. I thought he played a little bit faster than that. The Nailed show him. Preston Ebner from Baylor, five year player, leader on the team, 4.48. One of two Baylor running backs we have here. Mm -hmm. Jay, if, if you're not a pass protector, he said, you're not a first round draft pick. So I'll be anxious to hear your analysis of that. Yeah, it's a, it's a great call, and get on the field and stay on the field on third down is, is a big deal. Yeah, three down back. Absolutely. That's how you become a three down back. At right at now, at this point in time in his development, I think I'd rather have him getting out in the route because he's such a phenomenal receiver. He's, he's continuing to improve in pass protection. I think he still has a little work left to do there. Jerry and Ely, Ole Miss, 4-5 flat. Moving. It's a great time. Again, for that number that you're aiming for, for those top guys, 4-4-7. Four, four, we talk about... Uh, you know, 4-5 flat. Leonard Fournette was 4-5-1, so that's a name that gives you a comparison there. Jerome Ford's got legit speed. He should be one of the faster backs we see here. Those guys who built the culture that Luke Fickle was talking about in Cincinnati over the last few years. He was waiting in line at Alabama and decided to transfer to Cincinnati. 4-5-1. Well, Thought he might even be a little bit faster than that because when you watch him, you see some long touchdowns. 81 yards versus Central Florida, 79 yards versus Houston. Throw him back there, and it is downhill. Also gets some snaps as a Wildcat quarterback as well. 1,100-yard season. Now running down the sideline. 4-4-7. Oh, I didn't see. That's much faster than I thought he would run. That's a great time for him. Nicely done. On a so at... I'm, with the jumps, I'm thinking he's going to be in the low four fours. Here we go. 
that suffices. There you go. Low four fours, and they they come up all fours. There you go, Moses Malone. Lots of fours dude. from NC State. Running, run, running behind Icky. He's a kickoff returner. Four six two. He might be a little bit faster there. Here's an Keontae Ingram, Texas transfer there for the Trojans. Four six flat. Zonovan Knight. Could I get the now. boxing reference and I don't get the James Dude, Harden reference? As you might imagine, Mayock, Mayock is all over you. That's because he's a right Philly now. guy. He's, he's, he's You're watching all these Sixer games. You making excuses is a red flag, sir. Jeez. My back. It's my a kid. red flag. Pierce is rolling for a big back. Look, he's moving. Oh, he look, he's running a lot faster Four, than that. 6 6. He kept going until he ran a 60. 1 5 1 10 there. Two catches, no drops. Got some stop start quickness. Isaiah Pacheco, the run doctor, right? Yes. <laughs> okay. 4 4 7. Devontae Price here from Florida International. He's, he's got a running style. We talk about different styles of runners. He's got that Jamal Lewis, little choppy little steps. You now, Jamal could fly, but he did it three inches at a time as a runner. Like he, his feet just mm -hmm. never left the ground. Devontae Price. FIU. Popular time today. It is that. Forward. Lots of fours. Okay, we're going to get a bulldog here. Ronnie Rivers of Fresno State. Five years of 100 plus carries. I don't know if I've ever seen that before. Yeah, his total number of carries 672. 462 is his time. He's a tough kid, too. And he said in the middle of the season, he scores a touchdown. He's three yards into the end zone. The ball falls out of his hands. He immediately goes to Mel Tucker and apologizes to him. You know how to do that. 4-4-6. Four, four, the only other running back to win the Walter Camp Player of the Year Award in the last 10 seasons is named Derrick Henry. It's pretty good. First play of his uh, career there at Michigan State, 75-yard touchdown. Not a bad way to start. We miss him. You know, he was a good kid. He found his fortune somewhere else. But even when he was with us, nose for the end zone, anything from the 10-yard line in, terrific runner. Probably thinks he, you know, is going to has still has a chance, DJ, to expand his pass catching abilities. But yeah. as far as being a runner with vision, toughness, cutting ability, he said this kid's got it all, and he's a great young man too. Checked in at 214 pounds. He plays fast and can catch the ball. We'll see how he runs here, how he times. He is straining. Whoa, four, five, three. That's a solid time. It's of 15 plus yards. It's a big number. He stumbles a little bit, then he's moving. Four, three, nine. Well, I mean, DJ, in my years of, of running, I've told you're supposed to feel like you're going to follow. He'll remind me a little bit of Aaron Jones in terms of his running style. 4-7-2. He's going to want to run a little bit better the next time. He plays much faster than that. All right, so there's another run. So we'll take a break and we'll show you anything that we missed in Sear McCormick. Now this is a road runner. 4-6-1. Almost 1,500 yards last two seasons. On a simul cam that will cook. Dalvin versus James. <laughs> now, unofficially, we had Dalvin one one hundredth of a second faster than James. Are there two guys on the screen there right now? Are. I can't tell. And the simul cam backs it up. Wow. That much faster than his brother. Game of inches. Ryan Robinson. Yeah, he's. He didn't start a single game in his first four years at Alabama. And then this year, it was his rock to tote. 271 carries, 1,300 yards, 14 touchdowns. Waited his turn. He's a local 
4-6-3. Local guy from Tuscaloosa. So think about all those running backs sure. that you're in front that are in front of you and all the opportunities to leave with Damian Harris and Josh Jacobs and Najee Harris and Bo Scarborough. We got Zamir White coming up here. Talk to Shane Beamer, his coach at South Carolina. He loves this kid. He's ultra competitive. Said their very first walkthrough they had last February when there was no football being played. Said he caught a screen pass, ran 60 yards to the end zone, and a walkthrough. So everybody's at 50%. I turned to Enik Barre, a defensive end we're going to see tomorrow. I said, what's with this guy? He goes, coach, that's just the way he does it. And he said that's how he's done it every single time. 447. Does nothing slow. He's Tristan Ebner. Nice stride. 447. He knew it, too. He looked right up at the board. Yeah, when I, you know what's interesting about that? Running backs running 40s. That's right. He really stayed low coming out of there before opening up. So Tyrion Davis Price betters his time. Again, unofficially. Jerry and Ely. Ronnie Rivers. Fresno State. Okay. 